So I recently had a college player come in for a session and her feedback was that in wet conditions like we have right now, like we've had the past month here in Dallas, uh, that her wedges were coming out a lot higher and much less spinny than she was expecting. And she wasn't sure why, she was wondering if it was potentially the club face being wet or the ball being wet. So I decided to test it and here is what we found. Get these balls outside to prep them for our wetter balls to test the moisture against the club face. So I'm gonna put those out there to make it as realistic as we can. All right, so my blueprint shot is gonna be 60 yards. I like to hit 60 yard wedge shots because that's where club speed, ball speed, and carry distance generally add up to being a one to one to one ratio. They're all going to be uh, dry club face. So I'll be wiping it off in between each shot to make sure that uh, the consistency of the club face is the same. The only thing changing is the condition of the golf ball. So launch angle 28, spin 7500. A launch angle 29, spin 7800. Yeah. Oops. Yeah, we can see those are definitely wet. That is generally what a golf ball looks like uh, when it is raining or if there's some dew on the ground. What we're going to see is drops of water falling off, and that is going to be creating less friction with the club face, which I'm going to expect the ball to launch higher and spin less. Shot one. Oh my gosh. That, I could feel that slide up the face. Okay, that's 60 miles an hour ball speed. Launched at 33 with a spin at 6,300. That is pretty close to what I would expect and that is all due to the moisture on the golf ball. Creating that, that layer of water that produces like a slippage on the club face where it doesn't grab, but it kind of goes up the club face and launches higher and spins much less when the ball is dry. Club face is dry every time. So the next time you play in the rain, first off, try to clean the club face off. If you can, also dry off the golf ball. But for those situations that you can't dry off the ball, one, adjust your game plan that the ball is gonna come out higher and with much less spin. So the next time you play in the rain, make those adjustments to your golf game.